Team was a little tricky. simply going to evaluate the sum. This is a sum where I'm going to add up a bunch of components, right? So I'm going to take k, just like with my sequences and series, and plug it in. So if I plug 1 in here, do you see I get 3 factorial over 1 factorial? Good. And then now I click it up to the next number, so 2, so I'm going to get 4 factorial over 2 factorial. And the next number, the last number, I'm going to get 5 factorial over 3 factorial. Once I do that, now I evaluate each one. Well, 3 factorial is 3 times 2 times 1, and this is just 1, so the 1's cancel. So this whole, this first term just becomes 6. 3 times 2 is 6. I'm going to add to that 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 over 2 times 1. So the 2's and the 1's cancel, so I end up with 12. This is going to be 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1, all over 3 times 2 times 1. So this becomes 20. And that grand total is 38. So I think the tricky part for this one, you guys all know what, because you, you did it up above, you know what to do with everything that's green. It's you know just remembering that you just need to plug in one, get a number, plug in two, get a number. You're going from one to three. Just evaluate each one in the summation. 